regarding the difference between uh, these two pieces <clears throat> this is a folding saw as uh, many of you already knows and it works very well, well for small branches of this size even for this <clears throat> you can use it in a, with uh, the foldable uh, saw you have uh, to make uh, the, uh, the cut while pulling the blade <clears throat> this uh, for me this is the maximum size of the log to cut with this saw I've uh, seen uh, <clears throat> on the net many users that uh, prefer to use a foldable saw even if I don't know if the the word is appropriate and uh, they take uh, a katana thing I don't know the, of a silky of uh, 60 or even more uh, centimeters long I don't know you I can't uh, I can understand the <coughs> the meaning of that I'm not saying that uh, you can't use them but um, for me they, uh, you don't need them if you need to cut a small uh, log like this you can use this and uh, <coughs> it's really <coughs> And it's really useful because uh, you can uh, always put it uh, in your uh, small pocket and uh, in the case of need you just take it out and uh, use it like this. The problem with these are that um, they are very aggressive and uh, <coughs> the teeth are made uh, in the direction of the pulling like this so you will have to make a power while pulling the problem for me is that uh, if you don't pay attention and you don't have uh, experience with this with this using them uh, the longer side the longer uh, blades <coughs> tends to to blend because uh, even if you pay attention uh, you always uh, put some uh, strength on the pulling on the pushing <coughs> and so the blade blend blend a bit blends a bit and uh, sometimes you have the problem that you break the blade or, uh, or at least you you curve it <coughs> and then uh, it's uh, useless also these blades uh, are good but um, they are pretty expensive so uh, you can find also some of them uh, with a curve like this uh, in the blade the blade is curved and uh, it helps to a bit to man maintain the, the blade attached to, to the wood while pulling anyway uh, if you wa wander around uh, this is the perfect option on the other way on the other side the frame um, frame um, so like this <coughs> this is a particular one uh, made from uh, Gerber I will put the link uh, on the description and you can you can uh, just uh, fold it in your backpack like this in the case of need you just pull it here here and here you find this uh, hook here you can also make uh, one of these uh, in the wood with the wood I've made uh, <coughs> some a video many many years ago <laughs> how to do that and uh, in this case um, you have a blade which is uh, really cheap you can find them uh, for uh, two or three bucks around uh, in uh, every store <coughs> and uh, it's uh, really effective this is a short blade uh, but uh, if you stay in the camp this is perfect I have to say that uh, even if it's foldable this uh, one but uh, as you have seen uh, it's really different between uh, this 
that uh, makes takes much more time and also if you have uh, <coughs> to cut some branches uh, around you can't uh, find the right uh, position <coughs> to, to cut it with this <coughs> frame so while with this is uh, easier <coughs> sorry for my my voice even if uh, this uh, for branches even for branches like this and even if this uh, is a really a short blade for a, for a frame um, so it's much uh, more effective than this because you can make a <coughs> use your strength uh, pushing and pulling pushing and pulling you see this <coughs> only while pulling as I said I'm not saying that uh, you can't use them <coughs> on the contrary <coughs> they are really much more uh, much effective but um, as I said they are more expensive and uh, they tend to consume these uh, teeth after a while they wear out and uh, then you have just to throw them away this is not uh, foldable so you it's uh, more problematic to take it with you in uh, your trace but uh, if you have a camp like me this is perfect In case of like this, if you worry for your hands, <coughs> you can put it inside the, the, the arm, inside the, your hand, the cut. So even if the, the blade jump on the, on the wood, you won't cut yourself. When you have uh, reached this uh, level, you can put your thumb here. And be safe. And uh, one last thing about uh, this uh, foldable saw. <clears throat> uh, in my experience, uh, you can find them uh, in many range of prices. In my experience, if uh, you get one uh, at around uh, $15, 15 euro, it's uh, a good quality saw. Going uh, higher in the price doesn't uh, gain uh, too much uh, of a quality. I know that uh, the silky or uh, the baco are really famous and uh, for a good reason, I guess. Especially the baco have a good uh, shape of the handle and uh, it's in rubber, so it's better than this to to hold it. But um, the, the saw is not, uh, especially in this type of saw, uh, with the other the frame type is different, but uh, with this type of saw, you can't have to have them uh, in your hand for many, many hours. So for me, it's not a big deal to have a good uh, handle in this. <coughs> the, the silky are really famous because uh, someone uh, say that uh, they cut uh, really, really better than the others. Well, I, I, had, I had a few small, I don't remember the name, I guess, a small boy or something like this, uh, silky, and uh, it's a good saw, but uh, for me it's uh, overpriced and uh, it costs too much, it costs uh, really too much for me. Uh, you take a good one, 
<coughs> and uh, make your experience with this. When uh, it's uh, it's done, you just throw it away. And uh, believe me, believe me that uh, also a silky will uh, wear out with time. It's not uh, that uh, it will last forever. So my so my advice is, is that <coughs> you don't spend too much money in the foldable saw. This uh, type of saw uh, of Gerb Gerber is a bit expensive, uh, around the 50 bucks. But uh, I have to say that it's uh, lightweight, a bit not too much lightweight, but uh, it's lightweight, and it's uh, really <coughs> effective. And uh, to put it in your uh, backpack is a good option for this. And uh, finding the blades uh, in the store. Uh, at a really a low price uh, make this uh, a good deal for me because you if you don't lose it you will have a good saw for the rest of your life <laughs> you just have to to change the blades it's a good saw here also you have um, this small um, hook that you can uh, screw around a bit to change the tension of the blade but you can leave it uh, as you find it and uh, it will be uh, good Of course, uh, the difference is also that uh, with a uh, foldable saw, you don't have um, to worry too much about the size of uh, the, the log. I have to say, and it's not really completely true, but uh, anyway, you can uh, cut uh, any size of a log, only depending on the on the length of the blade. Eventually, you can cut. Uh, for me. A good um, measure is uh, half of the blade. You can cut uh, logs half of the blade. More than, than that, it's uh, difficult to to use this. <clears throat> but anyway, this is uh, the limit. While uh, with this, the limit is uh, this space here, of course, because uh, this is the space uh, when you can put uh, the log. Of course you can uh, rotate the log and uh, cut it after, after that. Conclusion, uh, uh, if you have to choose between these uh, two, there are uh, different tools. This is uh, perfect for the camp and uh, anyway if you want to um, take something with you, a saw with you, that uh, you could, uh, you can bring uh, along and use it uh, at the camp. <coughs> well, this uh, is uh, good for um, everyday use and uh, if you want to pack a really light. I won't uh, go further than uh, this uh, length for uh, the blade. <clears throat> but uh, it's uh, just your choice uh, for me given that uh, you have to to take the the blade really thin uh, <clears throat> the more you you uh, the more uh, length you add and the more is uh, tend to bend you see so when uh, you <clears throat> use it this way even if you try just to use the the power on uh, the pull, but uh, with the movement uh, really quick, uh, it's easy that uh, a longer blade will blend. 
for this tool you can also make uh, one of your own with wood as i said and uh, it's a good op option if you have the time and uh, a bit of skills but uh, not much it's an easy project <coughs> you can use them Just, you can do it this um regarding this gerber uh, i like it very much i have to say that uh, it's a bit heavy not um, really light 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 but uh, anyway it's not uh, not even uh, <coughs> heavy the rubber thing uh, handle here is perfect for the grip <coughs> it's a bit uh, small short the blade it's not very long but um, you can use it in the camp uh, without uh, <coughs> many problems <coughs> 